Here's a quick tutorial about how to use your Instant Pot to make boiled eggs. First, you should make sure that your liner is in your Instant Pot. Then, put in the trivet that comes with your Instant Pot. With the little feet down at the bottom and the arms spread out open and to the to touching the sides. Add one and a half cups of cold water to the bottom of your pot. Add however many eggs that you want to boil into your pot on the trivet, making sure that you don't let the eggs touch the sides. There's a gap between your egg and the side of the pot. Always make sure that your seal is firmly in um, the edge of your of your Instant Pot. Put the lid on and seal it. And make sure that your this little handle is turned over to the sealing part of your pot. Next you want to put your pot on manual and set it to five minutes. If you leave it on it will beep letting you know that it's set and ready to go. It will show on until it comes up to steam and then it will start the countdown. Once your pot seals it will raise up this little safety mechanism um, that keeps your pot from opening and it will completely seal off to start your pressurized cooking. Shortly it should start beeping and this on should turn to five minutes that we have it set on. When the five minutes is up it will beep again and then um, there it goes. When the five minutes is up it'll beep again and we will come and check on our eggs. When the cooking part is done, your um, your pot will beep at you. I mistakenly told you it would beep when it switched over to the cooking part and started the countdown, but it does not do that. But it will beep when it's finished, and it will start with this where it says L and then has time on it. That means that it's finished, and this is when it's just keeping it warm. And it will tell you how many minutes it's been keeping warm. So if you set it when you go off to work or something like that um, for a dinner then um, when you get back you'll know how many how long it has been done and and on warm you'll notice that the pen is still up and it's still in the sealing position um, we have to um, wait on the eggs where it has a natural release um, on the Instant Pot community, they call that NPR, natural pressure release. Um, if they say QPR, that means quick pressure release. Um, so we are going to leave our, um, our timer on until it hits five minutes. If you want to leave your, um, to do something else, you can set your phone. I'm going to set mine for four minutes because it's already got one minute on the clock so that my timer will go off and let me know when it has um, when it's ready to release the pressure okay when your timer goes off 
and um, you are ready to release the pressure of your Instant Pot. Notice that it's still in the sealing position and sealed. You can take a wooden spoon or your tongs or something like that. I usually use the wooden spoon and put it through the loop of my um, and just leave it hanging there by itself to slowly release it or you can put a little pressure on it and let the pressure out quicker. When it's finished your um, your little metal piece will go down meaning it's safe to open. Always get yourself out of the way and open it away from yourself just for safety. You can put your pot lid into the pot itself to hold it. Take your eggs out and put them in a ice bath. For five minutes. Once your timer goes off, you can get your eggs out of the egg bath. I typically get a little grocery bag and open it up so that I can crack the eggs within the, the bag. Look how easy they peel. Pill just kind of falls right off. Get a bunch of these eggs peeled and you can put them in a, a you can separate them into Ziploc bags so you can just grab and go and have a quick snack or breakfast. Hope this was helpful. Have a great day.